First of November, some 20 years ago, an infant with undecidedly grey-green eyes rolled its way into the world, thrilling two young parents with each lusty yell. Even as she grew, the thrill continued, reaching out now to her growing world of friends and strangers. At 21, she's done it again. With a brilliant flash of eyes and a hint of a smile, she's thrilled the world. And who is she, ladies and gentlemen? Aishwarya's tryst with fame began here in Goa. Amidst the backdrop of the sea, the sand and the surf, she claimed her place in the sun. Her incredible knack for hat-tricks first showed up at the Femina Miss India contest when she walked away with the three most coveted prizes, Miss Catwalk, Miss Ten and Miss Photogenic. She had one more prize to claim, had she talked her way to it. Einstein, Shakespeare and Mahatma Gandhi, whose contribution to the world do you think was the most important and why? Einstein, Shakespeare, Mahatma Gandhi. Mahatma Gandhi, to be very honest, because he taught us the spirit of non-violence, which is essential, which was essential yesterday, today and tomorrow. Thank you. Pageants today have changed their perception of beauty, almost redefining the phrase vital statistics to include the intellect a contestant may possess. The ability to think on your feet is as important as the ability to walk with them. For Aishwarya, it was a cakewalk. If you could miraculously change the course of one important historic event, which one will it be and why? The historic event I'd have changed the course of, my birth. Because I wish I were born earlier, so that I know that I would have been a leader of sorts and have definitely prevented the wars of this world. Thank you. All that stood between her and her halo of glory was a brief but interminable moment. And finally, the wait was over. She had invested herself and she had been rewarded. Miss India 2 title is Miss Aishwarya Rai. Namaste, I'm Aishwarya Rai, 21 years old, and come from the country of love, peace and harmony, India. And Miss World 1994 is Miss India. Congratulations to the lovely Ashwarya Rai.
The much awaited homecoming of Aishwarya Rai Miss World 1994 finally happened on the 16th of December. Waiting eagerly for her at the airport were her proud parents, a beaming Mr. Pradeep Puha, director of Times of India Publications, Femina editor Satya Saran, and ace designer Himant Trivedi. entire press world clamored to get a picture of her. We are here at the press conference held at the Taj Mahal Hotel Bombay, where Miss Eshwarya Rai shall be meeting the press for the first time after her crowning.
On her last leg of a hectic homecoming schedule, Aishwarya Rai, Miss World 1994, paid a visit to the Shraddhanand Ashram, an orphanage for abandoned and homeless girls in suburban Bombay. Biscuits, she spent time speaking with committee members from the ashram about the lives of the girls in the orphanage. They should be able to handle themselves in day to day life, but at the same time, they should be encouraged to um, also take up and follow up what, where their interests really lie in other activities. I mean, don't not always go them with bookish knowledge, they should also be the horizon should be broadened. <laughs> Moving on further, she spent time with the tiny toddlers at the ashram where her spontaneous rapport with the babies was a delightful sight for the onlookers. <laughs> The children of the ashram presented a moving program displaying their talents in diverse activities, proving unmistakably that though they were orphans, they were not without well-rounded personalities and unique talents and gifts of their own, which, if nurtured in the right environment, would flower and blossom in their own right. In her own words, there was admiration for their strength and encouragement for their endeavours. Aishwarya Rai touched down in the capital city Delhi along with her parents and Femina editor Satya Saran after completing a rather busy schedule in her hometown Bombay. She was greeted by photographers, adoring fans and people who just wanted a glimpse of the girl with the crown. Ash, just 21 years old, with the world at her feet, was welcomed in true Indian fashion. Aishwarya met the press where she answered a barrage of questions with utmost ease and confidence. The world's most beautiful cultural ambassador met with Mrs. Sonia Gandhi at her residence in New Delhi. The final leg of her schedule, Ash was proudly escorted by her family to Rashtrapati Bhavan, the residence of the President of India, Dr. Shankar Dayal Sharma. Thank you. 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 Thank you.